Hello everyone, Liliana from Vanilla and Canela here. Welcome back to my channel and to another video. It's a home bargains haul, everyone. It was worth the wait, I promise you. I got so much good stuff. I have not been to a home bargains, I want to say probably a couple of years, maybe, you know, there is not one. It's not that far away, it's still within my area, but it's not that close. To me so I don't tend to go very often so anyway I went I spent 89 pounds 89 yeah yeah and the first thing I got that I have to show you is this can you guess who this is for this is for Alex of course this was 6.99 it's a really sizable snake this was 6.99 which i thought really really good price so i was really pleased to find that for him also for alex i got him this meal tray just because he likes his food a little bit separate and i have one of these for um christmas but not one for him to use any other time so just got him this one. It's quite, quite cute, I thought. I also got, and I'm showing you this just as I pick it up from the counter, two mugs. The first one is this, Be Happy. This was, I want to say, less, it was 179 I think. I got this one, Be Happy. And I also have this one, Lazy Days. I thought these were really good. And they're the perfect size for my coffee so I was pleased with that I found this massive bottle of coconut moisturizers and nourishes mineral hand wash with natural dead sea minerals in coconut oil I basically got it because it was less than two pounds and it was um, massive so there's a liter of hand soap so I can refill my um, my soaps in the house and then I can use the bottle as well. I actually prefer this a plastic. It's a lot less heavier than glass. I have one in my kitchen, this one that I use for my washing up liquid. Um, and that was from a shampoo. So I can reuse that for something else. Again, great, great value. Having a coffee. I hope you are all doing well. Before I forget and I carry on, I mentioned in my last video that I was getting some um, chalk labels from Amazon. They did arrive and here they are. This is the pack that I got this time. It has my normal labels, but it also had these smaller ones and it came with two pens. I want to say this was like six or seven, I think maybe seven pounds. I will link those below for you guys. That's really good value. Okay, back to the haul. I picked up this Blue Dragon new street food satay skewers. Um, basically, it comes with everything. You just add the chicken. You marinate the chicken in one of these, and then you cook it. It just looks really, really nice. That was one seventy nine or one eighty nine as well. Got some more of flora. I tried this one from Poundland, the country garden, and I really, really like it. So I just got another one of those for a pound. Picked up some mascara. Now, I am not fussy. I will probably use that five times before it goes out of day. So I paid two ninety nine. It's actually um, Bourgeois, the brand. Let me see. There you go, the bourgeois brand there. So I think that's a good value for two ninety nine. Let me just turn you down a little bit. That, what happened? Just took a picture of myself. I I don't know what I'm doing, but anyway, two ninety nine. I thought that was really awesome. I picked up this candle. Yeah, I love that. It smells like bamboo. It smells like almost like grass. Um. Should I say grass? What do you think? Do you say grass or grass? Um, that smells really, really good. It says it smells of 
lotus blossom, fresh moss and bamboo. And that again was less than two pounds. I also got one of these little um, plastic books for Oscar for the bath. I would say it was like 49p, it's ridiculously cheap, even cheaper than you'd get it in Poundland. One of my favorite deodorants, though I am actually very happy with the deodorant I get from Aldi. I thought that works really well as well, but that was a pound. Got these lovely little panda lunch boxes. There's three in there. And again, not expensive. There's three different sizes. I thought these would be good for Oscar with snacks as we stop going out and things like that. They're a bit too babyish for Alex, so he says. Back to Alex, I got him a new bottle. I'm always, seems to me, always buying him bottles. He's very picky with the bottles and they get grimy really easy. What I liked about this one is there's no straw. Straws for me, I don't like it. But this opening is fairly small. Um, usually the ones he has, they're quite big openings and he's not too keen on those. But that was good. And again, it was good value, less than two pounds as well. Um, picked up these Easter cream pies. They're basically fluffy marshmallow filled wafer cups dipped in chocolate flavor, flavor coating. So you can see he's had one of them. He thought they were very good. There's not many inside actually. There's only four, but yeah, just as a little, little treat. Also for Alex, I picked up this um, tray, this lap tray, children's lap tray. Um, I thought that was quite good because he does like having his snacks sitting on the sofa. And I thought that is quite good. Again, I think that was like £3.50 maybe, which I thought was good. Now, picked up a, a Lazy Susan. This was £1.50, one forty-nine. Um, one of these. I have in my cupboard right here, uh, one where I've made it with, um, what do you call it? Made it with two loaf, two cake tins and some marbles. This is actually cheaper. You know, like if you get everything from Poundland, you're paying one pound for each tin plus the marbles. You're looking at three pounds. This was 150 and I thought it's about time I upgrade. And I like that it has a fairly dip, deep lip, so it will keep things in order. Also got one of these sofa trays. I bought one of these before and I ended up giving it away uh, to my in-laws uh, many moons ago. But actually there is one side of our sofa where we don't have a table and it's usually where we feed Oscar. So it'd be nice to use that, you know, and be able to put like a cuppa on there as well. Um, picked up two things of floor wipes, so 59p each. And then I got Alex some toothpaste. Also got some nappy bags. And then saw these, got this cereal as well for Alex. I'm nowhere near finished, you guys. There's so much stuff. Um, what else? Some little mini eggs. I doubt it they'll make it till Easter, but we'll try. Also, they had only one uh, Yankee Candle votive, I think they're called. And it was this one, and it's White Lily. Yeah, White Lily. It smelled quite nice, so I just got the one. This was like 79p, which I thought was good. Picked up a reusable mask. This one actually comes with a little pouch, which I had not seen before. And I thought that was really good. I thought, yeah, I'll keep that in the car or in my bag or something like that. And then two of these baskets. Now I have the Curva baskets of these, which were like £2.49. I also have the 
uh, Poundland ones, which were a pound, and these were 99p. So the cheapest I've seen so far. They're not the really small ones. They are, you know, decent size. So I got two of those. They'll come in handy for sure. What else? I also picked up some Pink Lady apples just because I just fancied it. I got a little thing of tortellini. This was 69p. Aldi's cheaper, for sure. I got one of these a shower, detangle shower brush. I basically, the only time I brush my hair now is in the bath, pretty much. And I have one of these. I wanted to get another one because that one's starting to get a little bit ropey. So that, I'm not sure how much it was. Again, less than a pound. I'll put it on the screen if I can. I also picked up a load of different cards. They had really reasonable cards. I have a fabulous day, so a happy birthday one. Really like pretty and girly. Um, happy birthday is party time. These were, look at that, 39p. There's another one for 29p. These are just to add to my stash. And this one is for Paul. If you couldn't guess that, that would be from the boys to, to him. Got Alex this Avengers brush. It's an electric brush. I'm not gonna press it because it, it talks for like two minutes, different quotes from the Avengers. But I thought that was really good. 179, I think. Got some green tea. I don't drink it, but I like having it for my friend Jill. Some hot dogs. Picked up some Easter. I did get some other little Easter chocolates, which I'm going to put away for Easter and we'll see if they'll make it. Um, some napkins. We don't use this very often, just when we have guests. Most of the time we use the cloth napkins. Saw these bars, I've never tried them before. Uh, Bliss, enjoy me guilt free. Salted caramel whip bars, gluten free, and there's five in there. Thought they looked quite good for 99 calories. Also got some Germoline antiseptic cream for no reason than, you know, to add to my first aid kit. They had a huge selection of stuff you could get really affordably some wipes and also I don't know if you guys have ever tried this saw this it's like uh, face neck and hands cream thought this would be good for as my night cream something really hydrating the same for my hands and how amazing that you do that you do that and then you do that done in one go so I could not resist that thought I'll let you know if it's any good Okay, so I also picked up some muffin cases. It actually says cupcakes, but these are quite big. I think there's more like muffin sized. The only Easter decoration I got was this. It's like a wooden, wooden bunting. It is says happy Easter, if you guys can see. I thought that was quite good. Again, really inexpensive. Um, yeah. I'm trying to keep it simple this year. Another thing of wipes. Got some Nutella because, well, I don't need to explain that. Picked up some fruit strings for Alex. And also I got this for Paul, for the garden. Uh, it's some soft twist ties. Look, you just, you just cut them. There's five meters to do, you know, for plants and things like that for the garden. Just saw them and I got them on a whim. Got some little scrunchies. There's like that one, a net one and a little soft one. That was again, 50 or 60p. And then got three spices. Well, got turmeric, paprika, and I also got some pepper with a built-in grinder, black pepper. So these were like 39p each. I can't remember, but not, not a lot of pepper. And then finally, you guys, 
I save the best for last. Look at these. Now, these IKEA sells these. I I want to say they're usually like nine ninety nine. I might be wrong in IKEA, but Aldi also has them now for four ninety nine. And four ninety nine is how much I paid for them in Home Bargains. I actually got three, and they're not a bright white. They're kind of a soft white, more towards the cream. If that makes sense. I intend to do a little makeover in my pantry at some point, maybe in the summer or something. Um, and I wanted to use some of these. I, th I thought this was so, so well priced. And that is it, you guys. That is all that I got. I hope you have enjoyed it. I definitely enjoyed myself. It's been way too long since I've been to Home Bargains and it was worth it. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments what was your favourite item. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.